Well, I'm going to give that easy crap another shot. Um, I don't know for a fact that this camera works with sound. We haven't proven that. So the first thing we're going to do is hook it up to a known good working monitor and video source or video display, whatever you want to call it. This is going through, it's hard for you to see, but back in there that little red light is on something called a VGA up converter. In fact, I think I have a flashlight. You can see that kind of green box if the LEDs don't wash it out. I don't know what it even says. It says AV something on it. But uh, it has composite going from cable box. I know the clock up there is blinking. I have to reset it. And the composite output of the cable box runs up through the ceiling and over to that screen there. So whatever's on the TV will be displayed over there. We'll just wait for that to come up. And uh, I don't know what this is. MacGyver, fine, whatever. So let's go over to the other screen. Okay, now if I turn the screen on, it'll turn on and then probably go to power save. Yes, it did, it turned yellow. That's because it's hooked up to the computer that's tucked in back here. So if I press the button on it, it clicked. And it says S video, no sync. Once again, composite video. And here's this uh, Mike Ditka or whatever dick with this bullshit car shield thing. And that works. And just put the speaker on. Oops, there we go. That's why I have car shield. Okay, so that works. The composite is hooked into this dead VCR. It just has bad belts on it. And if I change the input to line two, let me go kill the TV on the other side. There's some ground interference when I get close in that, but whatever. Video and audio are hooked to the front panel uh, AV in. I set it to that particular line. Camera's hooked up. Everything's right here. And I should be able to power it on. Okay. And we do have a picture. And this is what it's seeing. So we know that works. If I tap on the mic... Absolutely nothing. So apparently the camera... Either the sound isn't working or... It's not outputting sound on a live feed. A VHS videotape. We'll set it over to VCR mode. I forget which way. I guess that way. Yeah, VCR. Hit eject. Put in the tape. This has some pre-recorded material on it. hit play the uh, thing on top ah the Cali light is flashing the counter the is going. sound works it says index which means it's writing an index the sound works so it doesn't output with a live feed now we have to try that okay so the yellow is on the left the red is on the right the yellow is white, and the other one is red. So the white goes into the yellow for video, and the red goes into the white. Let's launch the stupid software. See if that even wants to load today and even capture anything. Um, I guess maybe I should put it over to video mode just so we get a picture, it's probably going to be, well, it's real close, but... So once this ever loads, that'll be a great thing. I have no idea why it's taking so long. It may just not run anymore, I, you know. You just don't know with this. Here we go. And with any luck, I'll move the camera back a bit. We should get a live feed of that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I 
think it's hearing that microphone. Hello, hello. No, it's definitely here in this one, so let's fix that. Okay, it theoretically is set. I have this back on VCR mode. We will press play. We have a picture. The, uh, thing on top. It fucking the works! Flashing, the counter is going. What the shit? Index, which means it's writing an index it worked all along. Just because the microphone didn't work on this yeah. in live feet. Who the fuck would have known this? Holy living shit. After all that. Alright, let's try a quick capture. I can't believe this actually works. I don't care what the display looks like right now. You know, one of the best parts is the screen's black and white. You know, just because... That's how it was back then. That's how it was. Okay, let's get the... what do you call it? Up. Controls panel. We'll hit stop. This is now a live feed. I'll press stop over there. That stops. And if I go here and double click. Okay. And of course, you know, one of the best parts is the screen is black and white. Oh, it really does capture that yeah, horribly. Because that's how it was back then. That's how it was. Huh. So stop recording now and play that back. That's fucked up. That is fucked up. It's not, it's not, it's not oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah. And back. And of course, you know, one of the best parts is the screen is black and white. You know, yeah. just because... That's how it was back then. That's how it was. <laughs> so we'll stop recording now and play that back. It actually works. It was all that. Who would have ever, I've never in my entire life seen a camera, even the one I'm recording with now, outputs live sound with live feed. I don't know if there's a setting or a switch or some crazy shit like that on it. Uh, not, not that I ever saw on it, but I've never seen a camera do that. I understand why they don't because of the microphone and the feedback that you might get with the TV in that. But, uh, yeah. Okay. So, I think it works. Now, as far as the quality goes, well, let's go to property setting. And it's set at 640 by 480. I want to bump it, but I'm going to change this down to normal. And that probably is close to what I have. And we'll leave it at that. And I'll do some other test captures here. So I think there should be more on the tape. I'll simply hit record and hit play on the camera. It shows play. Sweet. Oh, it's like even worse. Alright, well let's change it down maybe. now. Okay. So, I don't know if there's a pause. Yeah, I see the reflection. Oh, there is. See it. Okay. I hit pause. Wow, you even see the video artifacting stuff with that. Go to control. I don't know if you can actually do this, um, you know, midstream. I guess not. Sweet. You want to see uh, me hold it up? Well. Point, video. point. Yeah, I want to look at the screen. Point, point your camera at me. Okay. Yeah, I see the reflection in yeah, here. Yeah, you can see it. <laughs> so property setting. We'll change this to. <laughs> I don't want to go any lower than that. Uh, let's set it to fastest. 
and try that. Now that looks like a better display. Let's hit record. And we'll hit play. Let's, uh, let me stop for a second. I, I wonder if it shuts when I stop recording. Okay, now we're recording, and the only light that you see is from... Well, there's not too the much going way. on here, so and let me stop and rewind. I think it's still rolling, so I'll hit play again. Or did I want to do that? Yeah, I did. Tape's loaded. The uh, thing on top. The tally light the sound is, is the not is synced going. with the... It says index, which means it's writing an index to the tape. That was actually pretty advanced. That allowed you to search Let's the see different it... tracks on the tape. And stuff. Yeah, uh-huh. Pretty advanced for the time. So anyway, that's there. We'll try zooming in and out a little bit. We'll look at my camera. Well, it seems to sort of work. I think we'll have to try a little bit more powerful uh, machine. Maybe this little atom processor just can't do it. So let's now do something else with this now that we've confirmed it works. Let's try to break it again. Let's, uh, let me stop for a second. I, I wonder if it shuts when I stop recording. Okay, now we're recording, and the only light that you see is from whatever's coming in from the other room. And that's actually picking up a considerable amount. It's very noisy, but even yeah. so, and that's when I block the, yeah, it's uh, hard to do the light here. Tally light is flashing, the counter is going. It says index, which means it's writing an index to the tape. That was actually pretty advanced. That allowed you to search the different tracks on the tape and stuff. Yeah, uh -huh. Pretty advanced for the time. So anyway, that's there. We'll try zooming in and out a little bit. We'll look at my camera. If it'll, I guess it won't focus on it. It's on, it's on, oh, oh, yeah, it's on oh, there focus. It is. There it goes. Okay. Yeah. And back. And of course, you know, one of the best parts is the screen is black and white, you know, yeah. just because... That's how it was back then. That's how it was. <laughs> so we'll stop recording now and play that back. Once again on the VHS. Whoa. Oh, yeah. Okay, now we'll try the old Mac computer here. This is uh, the fastest machine that I actually own. It is supposedly not compatible with Windows 10, so we'll see if uh, <laughs> what'll happen with that. Um, we'll just let it do its thing here. Let it go. Um, I'm using my external optical drive. The drive in here does work, but it's a slot load. And with that little miniature disc, if you've seen the other videos, I don't want to take the chance. It, it might take them, it might not, and I don't want to break nothing, so I figure I'll just leave that for regular ones. So anyway, we'll let the software install, put in the product key, which I have verified indeed is the same for all of them. We'll see what happens. Could not initiate the capture device. Well, I do still have it unplugged. But the other one worked with the webcam. We'll hit OK. <laughs> Initialization fail. And fuck a you. So now we'll close it. And plug this full thing in. Okay, we got our light. We got a Windows sound. And we'll wait an hour and a half for that to happen. For just a second and a half. 
All right, allegedly that's in. Uh, does this have a pause key? It does. Hold on. Let's see what Device Mangler says. Let's see if it shows up anyways. Mm, OEM capture, yes. Okay, so that worked. I'm sure it still won't work. Oh! Yeah, hey, it works! That's the counter display. Uh, let's just go for broke and hit play. See what the fuck happens, right? A lot of fringing on that. The, uh, thing on top. Oh, look at that capture! I mean, I'm not capturing yet, but it certainly is working. That was actually pretty advanced. That All right, let's see if we can actually get a successful capture out of this. Yeah. Speaking of which, this is not compatible with Windows 10. And this is definitely Windows 10. I just showed you that. But I'll do it again. Windows 10 Home. Okay, I have it set to the absolute highest quality. I don't know why this screen is like gray. But we'll hit record. We'll hit play. And obviously, I'll trim this up after. Hopefully, the play will go away in time. The uh, thing on top. The tally light is flashing. The counter is going. It's capturing, it and it looks like it's doing a good job. Okay, let's let it run. It's actually pretty. It works. Perfect. All right, so the easy crap isn't that crap after all. This one, as a matter of fact, I didn't even have to fuck around with the composite and the other bullshit. But then again, I didn't like the webcam on this machine. I don't know if that's a Windows 10 thing or whatever it is. But anyway, it does work. And that's good to know that it works with Windows 10, which I'm never going to use because it's absolutely awful. And in the near future, I will be reloading this particular machine with Windows 7. Thank you for watching. Make sure you click like. Make sure you click subscribe. And take care. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.